Hey everyone, my name is Valentino and welcome back to my channel. Happy Mardi Gras, or do you even say happy Mardi Gras? I honestly don't even know and that's why this video is a low-key perfect because today I saw an article and I was like, you know what? I really don't know that much about Mardi Gras. So it says there are 10 things, well it's gonna list 10 different things that you didn't know about Mardi Gras. And I don't know much, but um, yesterday I needed to go to Target and I saw something about Mardi Gras and I was like, you know what? How about we do a video with me painting on my body with Mardi Gras colors, doing like a little outfit. Like imagine if I were gonna go out and do like a parade, cause I have friends that went to New Orleans and I'm like, oh my God, I've never been to New Orleans and um, I'm, I really wanna go one day. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that definitely one day in the future. But I thought like, what if I were gonna go, I would definitely like <laughs> do it myself, paint a uniform and see how that goes. And I told my roommate, I was like, oh yeah, I got some body paint and some glitter and some clay like some colored clay and he was like what's the clay for and i was like i don't know you could like mold and make some stuff and glue it on me or whatever and he was like i still don't understand what's the clay for and i was like what do you mean and he was like sounds like some kinky shit to me and i'm like Ooh. i might as well go ahead and say this since you know Wow. I mean, while we're here in the beginning of the video, I might as well say that I do have an OnlyFans. So if you want to follow it and after I get my outfit ready, I'm going to do a little fun, sexy video over there. Make sure to see that if you want to see a little bit more of my body. A link will be in the description box down below. Oh, this is perfect. I used to love to play with sticky tack. This reminds me of that. Okay, so I put my hair up because obviously I don't want any paint in my hair. And I got a glove because I think it would be a little bit easier, especially like if I need to like, you know, I want to have one clean hand, one painty hand. And then let me open this glitter as well. And I don't have any glue, so I'm going to use honey and I hope that'll work. And a little tidbit about me, if you didn't know, purple is like one of my favorite colors. I love purple, gold, and black. And it's like pretty much <laughs> great with Mardi Gras. I'm not a great fan of green, but I do, I mean, green looks good on me. But 10 things that you didn't know about Mardi Gras. Okay, so it says Mardi Gras is um, the French term for Fat Tuesday. I didn't know that actually. Um, we'll do some purple nips. And apparently it lasts from January 6th all the way until February 13th. So right before Valentine's Day. Oh, that's weird how it's different here because, or is it every 20, um, or whatever, or I don't know. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not the one to know about these things. <laughs> Get her to match. Number two, since we have purple, I'm just gonna keep one where I know I'm gonna want a little more purple. So it says the first North American Mardi Gras um, was celebrated and Alabama and not Louisiana. Oh my God, that's so crazy. Cause you know, now Louisiana is the Mecca. I was just talking about New Orleans. And then it says uh, traditional colors are purple, green, and gold. So yeah, I pretty much knew that. And then it says the king cake, a traditional dessert has biblical roots. So it says Marco became the celebrations we know today because of secret society. Ooh. Sounds like my cup of tea. And there are more than 70 secret societies or crews involved in today's Mardi Gras festivities, which is, ooh, good thing I have the tarp down, which is kind of, ooh, which is kind of cool to think about like secret societies in general like 
I bet you there's so many secret societies that like literally only like 3,000 people know about. It's so exclusive. Or like literally only 200 people know about it, but it's still like um, like literally something that everybody will want to know about, but literally only 200 people do. Like, ooh, I can't wait to get into those days. Oh my gosh, so Russian royalty has attended the New Orleans festivities. That's kind of cray cray. Like, to think that, well, not to think that, but like, just like American people will go other places where, you know, nobody really knows who they are. And it's just like, y'all are, this is like literally like, y'all are so lucky, but that's cray cray. A royalty is literally just walking around. Just walking around. And it says, each year, one ruler anointed as the king of the carnival. So that would be me one year. If I were like into that type of thing, I'd be like, one day I will be the king of the festival. <laughs> and then watch it would like never happen. That would be the story of my life. I mean, that is the story of my life, should I say. Um... Yes! Look at that! Okay, okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Oh my God, so it says it's actually illegal to wear a mask on New Orleans, except for Mardi Gras. That's crazy. Like, is it illegal to wear masks, like, typically places? Like, that's weird. Not weird, but that's like cray cray. Guys, is this considered like um, offensive if I paint my nipples pink? Let me know in the comment section below. Because technically, I mean, I have met black people with pink nipples as well as I've met white people. Well, I guess technically that would be a spicy white, but white people with brown nipples. But there's one more thing that we probably didn't know about Mardi Gras, and it says each crew hurls party favors. Yeah, see, that is my type of party. Oh, and of course, the only other thing I know about Mardi Gras is the fact that if like um, somebody throws bees at you, that means you're supposed to like flash them or whatever. That's it, right? Okay, so I'm gonna try some glitter, but I don't have any glue. So I'm gonna try some honey and see if that'll like, you know, get it to stay. Oh, dang. And then maybe get some over here. Oh shit. Oh, it's sticking. Yes! So, while we're doing this, I guess, we might as well talk about some other stuff. Also, I wanna know, do you guys like celebrate Mardi Gras? Like, is that something that any of you typically celebrate every year, you know, yearly? There's like a thing that you do with your friends. Oh, <laughs> so I do have friends that like, you know, are in New Orleans and you know, they book their trip as soon as they can to make sure they get those good prices. Yes. <laughs> and um, like, what do you guys do? Like if I were gonna um, go to New Orleans let me know in the comment section, like, what I should do, where I should go, how I should go about it, because I'm definitely gonna plan to do that one year. Maybe you should, we can do like a meet and greet. Maybe I went overboard with the um, glitter. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> it's really hard to like try to do this and then talk about stuff at the same time. Okay, so there's one thing that I've kind of low-key wanted, but I'm just not gonna do it. There's a ring around my bicep, so we're gonna do it. We're gonna try to get in this ring. Yes, I got a ring. Oh yeah. Although, this is stupid because <laughs> my arm goes down. Maybe I should just go ahead and press it. <laughs> yeah, this is how all the Instagram guys make their arm look big. This is what I used to do. I used to just press it against my arm, you know, get that good angle. Look how fucking thick it looks. Oh yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so what do you guys think? This is cute or whatever, right? <laughs> All right, so I think I've done enough. Um, I'm not sure if this is like a cute Mardi Gras outfit or what. What do you guys think? Would you go out with me in this outfit? <laughs> Would you guys go out with me in this outfit? Yes. <laughs> Anyways, happy Mardi Gras. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And again, I'm just gonna <laughs> run on over to my OF and do a cute little video. Um, comment down below what you guys think. Give this video a thumbs up. All my links to any other social media will be in the description box as well. If you, you know, look there, make sure to look there. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what you guys think. And if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below as well as the bell next to it. So make sure you're notified every time I post. Until next time.